Hey babies, what's up my darling MVPs and how are you all doing? Welcome back to Sale with Mimi Shosli Mimi where you get a gist. I see they do waiting. I see they hurt. Of course you know there is no sleeping on your bicycle on this channel if it snows you do what? You lose. Are you yet to subscribe to this channel? Or are you still sitting on a fat, long thing? Kindly pause right there. Subscribe. And make sure you turn on the notification bell. If not, tell me. How do you want to get a gist brewing from the cooking pot? Like, how do you want to get a gist? I see they hurt. So, guys, yes, we have the top eight right here. But excluding young papi, we have Willie, Sinaye, Liema, Makeke, Mpumi, Mac Jr., Z, and Papa Ghost. You know, this eight housemates are going to be, you know, fighting for the <laughs> penultimate head of house. Like, who is going to win it? Hmm? Who is going to win it this penultimate week? Like, guys, you know, out of all the head of house games, you know, each of them are important because it's save each housemate for the week. But you see, this particular one is still the finale. No stress at all. So the thing is, whom are you rooting for? And who would you love to see win the title tonight? Let me know. In the comment section, while you let me know, let me take you guys along as Biggie had diary sessions with some of the housemates. So I'm going to be discussing that of um, Sinaye, Z, Liema, Mpumi, Willie, and um, who again? Then Willie, yes, six of these housemates, I'm going to be discussing their diary session. So the first housemate to get to the diary room was Sinaye. So Sinaye in his diary session, Biggie asked him, how does he feel to be safe again, you know, being in the night week? And baby boy was like that. He feels so, so, so happy. And at the same time, he got so emotional because, you know, having been saved back to back, that at the point in this house, he was like any which way in a way you get. But right now, getting saved and getting closer to the money last night while he was trying to lay on his bed he now realized that his family really do need this money that this is one thing he has never thought of ever since he joined this game so because he is getting closer to the money he was like yo truly we really need this money that it, it was it was that moment he realized that he needed to win this money all this why he just came to the game just be like if i survive this week fine but getting closer to that two million rands it'd be like no we really need this money there is a whole lot my i and my family need this money for and then biggie asked him about young papi leaving and then he said that he's always having mixed feelings about housemate leaving in as much as it is a good thing that it is a step ahead for people who are still in the house as it makes them get closer to the money but at the same time it really got feelings when he gets to it and that when his own best friend left that is tacky he got to him the more you know, so Biggie asked him about the team of this week, which is the get influenced, you know. And then he said what he think about the team of this week is that he think is a good one, knowing fully where them, them already. This is the lifestyle they are going to be living after they leave Big Brother's house because mostly they are going to be living as an influencer. So he think this is an opportunity for them to build this up, you know. And then Biggie asked them about wagering 80%. And he said he think the wage, um, the 80% they did wager is cool. And then Biggie asked asked the very important question which we are looking forward to tonight is how prepared is he for this head of house game you know knowing fully well that you really want to get a spot to the finale so wow, how do you feel he now said yes he really want to win this head of house game but at the same time there is one thing he's not going to do that's because biggie asked him he has always get close to winning but yet he do not win so but he said something he said there is one thing he's not going to do is suck over not winning just like the last time that he got close and then did not win you know that he would just be like whatever happens happens okay that was that about sinaye's diary session so after sinaye was our baby clown z what a beautiful clown she is <laughs> so z in her diary session was asked the same thing about um how she feels you know being safe again this other week and then she said big brother i personally i am happy but at the same time 
a part of me is so sad because I had to watch young Papi leave, you know. So she said she is really not happy that um, young Papi left the house the way he did. And then Biggie asked her how she feels about getting dagger from young Papi. And then she said that she is not surprised getting the dagger from young papi that already when they were in the house young papi they already have the conversation and young papi said if he leaves this house before z that he's gonna be throwing the dagger to her so immediately young papi left she'd be like yo i'm obviously gonna be receiving this dagger so she already knows she would be receiving the dagger and then biggie asked her if she was surprised about young papi leaving and she said biggie so I am I am more sad than surprised because in your house anything can happen. One person needed to go. I am really not on the part of surprise, but I am really on the part of being sad, knowing that young Papi left the house. And then Biggie asked her about the head of house, this penultimate week that what's up, you know, and then she'd be like, Big brother, this head of house, I am so bothered about this. That is even making me feel nervous at this time because I really need to, you know, win today's head of house. So afterwards, Biggie asked her about about the team of the week gets influenced and what she thinks about it and she'd be like she is so happy about this team because on a normal that is what she does that when you hear of z you hear of an influencer so it is something that she do outside of the house at ease you know so it is so sweet to see that it is now implemented in their wage attacks you know so it is a sweet thing to see and yes sinaya even said knowing that they have this but this team this week that he really missed um young papi because young papi is a videographer and they need to video and all of that so that young papi came to his mind when this wage attacks was being briefed to them each and every of the housemates who went to their diary session biggie ended it with a congratulations to them in making it to week nine in case i did not mention in each of the diary sessions okay after z2 was makeke makeke my boy somebody that would always look and smile you know so makeke in his diary session said he feels like he's an open book where he would open himself so biggie would see how happy he is to have make it to this week nine that he is filled with joy and he also spoke about young papi leaving you know the game is the game it is what it is and then about um um, tonight's head of house baby boy said he really want to win this one you know and then for the team of the season week which is the being, get influenced he said he's not gonna lie that this particular team is a new one to him that he's not he does not know anything about influencing or anything that has to do with being influenced but he wants to use this opportunity that thank god he is in the house right now and they are actually doing the stacks that he wants to use this opportunity to get to learn more about what it takes and how it is being done so after my kk was um liema Liema reviewed how happy she was, you know, to see the week now. Like she was jubilating and was so happy. She said she doesn't know there is one thing that always happens to her that whenever she's up, she just see herself leaving that door. Like she see herself getting close to leave, you know. So each Sunday that comes, like not like she does not have confidence in herself, but each Sunday that comes and she's standing up, she always sees herself as the person who might be living through that door and she'll be asking herself inside her mind be like oh hope is not this week hope is not the sunday hope this is not the sunday i'm living you know all those kind of question and then she said and again big brother my prediction was right because yes young papi had to leave you know so for the third time she has been right you know and then she was like that it feels so sad for, to see young papi leave but at the same time it is what it is now talking about feeling so sad why was even Liam cry, crying yesterday when young papi was leaving like she she cried more than the bereaved <laughs> <laughs> wow, how to be like bicycle. Liema is indeed a drama queen. Anyways, and then Biggie asked her about this head of house. She said, Omo, she must win it though. That you know that winning this head of house means you're going to the finale. So she really needs to win this one. I said her heart. Like she's not ready to relent that all her power and might is going on to this head of house game and then she was asked about the team get influenced and then she said she would not say she knows too much about influencing but she knows some little thing about influencing hence she is gonna she, she find this wager interesting and at the same time everybody needs to allow everyone shine in this particular wager because she said she's gonna be a host and then she saw papa goes frowning at it you know that she do not care all she knows is she's gonna she has actually handled podcasts post show so she doesn't know why um um her being a host is gonna be a problem and then big brother advised her to stand her ground and make sure she gets 
the roles that she needed, you know. Afterwards, Biggie also congratulated her to week nine. After Liema was really... Willie in his diary session was so happy at the same time he said he actually had em emotions last night because he had this feelings that couples are the ones selling if you watched my video when i was discussing about the, nom um, the nominated housemate diary session you would see that Willie be like oh that he is he's playing solo and he think he might go home so he's telling biggie that he was actually blaming himself you know was like maybe he was actually looking at other people and not actually admiring himself you know for him to have gotten saved actually gave him the feeling of you are doing something right you know for people to find him worthy you know and then about young papi that left that he actually felt bad because young papi is his favorite person in the house and then young papi is so vibely and everything he's so surprised to see that all he has put in into the game was not enough to make him stay you understand so that is how he feels about um young papi leaving and then biggie asked him about tonight head of house um, this week being the penultimate week and then he said that he doesn't want to think it too much because when he thinks it too much when he gets to the arena he's gonna panic so he's just gonna take it as he goes you understand he's not gonna reason it like that until he gets to the arena he's gonna put in his best if it has to do with physical um challenge he would also put in his best and then for the team being um get influenced you know so he said um that is actually gonna be an interesting one that each and every of the housemates is gonna have their various roles you know it's gonna actually help each and every of the housemates come together and get something done that it, at this point that is something him he likes you know a part of him does influencing outside of the house too that is something he does naturally just like this said about herself you know but at the same time there are groups in the house and everybody cannot do everything so that at this point you have to step back a bit for others to shine after Billy was mpumi am i the only one who love how biggie calls mpumi mpumi <laughs> report to the diary room so anyways um mpumi's diary session she's so happy to have make it to the ninth week like she's so filled with joy she was thanking her fans you know and family everybody who has actually make her showcase more of herself so she's so pleased and said she she promised she's not going to let you guys down as you guys keep her in the house. And about young papi's eviction, and he said that it was just all of a sudden that they were being asked question, and then Lawrence came immediately straight to business without even looking, blinking twice. He was just like, young papi, you have, you, you understand, leave the house immediately. He did not even give chance or anything, you know, for the housemate to actually breathe in from the question that he's just asked them. So according to Mpumi, it was just so sudden, young papi leaving the house like that. And then she was like, if she, if young papi left the house like this, what about her? What about others, you know? And then Biggie asked her about the night head of house game. She said it is either she win or she wins. That it is a win-win for her that she needed to win this one. Because, guys, that she was speaking to herself last night and be like, Omo, this head of house um, challenge is something we need to win. Like, that she really needs to win this one to avoid any story. Because in Biggie's house, anything can happen. When they got to this house, they told them there's going to be... So so many plot twists you know happening in the house so they do not even know where they stand in biggie's house and then they've seen um scenarios playing different from this season unlike it's quite different from what they have experienced in other in zanzi season so then at this point they do not know what biggie's hold for them so she thinks they her only in hope right now is winning the head of house and biggie asked her about the team get influenced and then she'd be like um yes that the housemates have to join hers together and make sure it works and then she started lamenting on what papago said about liema that papago saying liema is the best out of all of them was a wrong thing just like this task for example everybody needs to bring in their own two cents and then they will join it together to make it form that some people are good with some areas you know she started preaching the same thing she was trying to explain other people are good in some other areas so she do not accept the notion of saying one person you know is actually better than others you can have that mindset by yourself and not put it to other people's hearing so that was how Mpumi ended up her own diary session and that is how Mimi Shosni Mimi is going to be ending this video right now as it hurts to see you guys later thank you so so much for always sailing with me bye for now babies